Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. The euthanasia medication most vets use is pentobarbital, a seizure medication. In large doses, it quickly renders the pet unconscious. It shuts down their heart and brain functions usually within one or two minutes. It is usually given by an IV injection in one of their legs. Take our lead! Let's help you make your mark. Q2, how many Tylenol PM does it take to kill a dog? ANS, a single regular tablet of 325 mg is enough to kill a dog weighing 14 pounds within 48 hours. However, it's good to consult your vet as results may vary according to the weight of the dogs. Take our lead! Let's help you make your mark. You can try using the medication Benadryl, which contains the ingredient diphenhydramine. Diphenhydramine is an antihistamine used primarily for allergies, and in humans and in dogs, it can act as a mild tranquilizer. Talking to a veterinarian when using any sort of sedative or tranquilizer is recommended. Make your mark, take our lead. Valerian and chamomile are both naturally sedative herbs often found in calming supplements. Some sprays and plug-in diffusers contain synthetic versions of calming canine pheromones. You can also buy CBD products for dogs in areas where it's legal. Take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Dr. Gladstein says, if your animal is in pain, then it becomes much more of an immediate issue, and letting them die naturally is really cruel and unusual punishment. She says that if you determine that their pain can't be mitigated by any mild pain relievers, then the decision should be made to let the animal go. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.